Tony and Keir clearly get on incredibly well. Uh, they've got a real chemistry between them. I've seen them speaking together in public events and I know they speak to each other uh, behind the scenes as well. And that's a really important thing because it means that Keir understands Tony is a really important Labour leader because he used to win elections. We've had too many Labour leaders who want to say, I want to have nothing to do with, with, with Tony. So I think they've got similarities in that they know that the centre ground of politics is where Labour has to be to win. And they've both got similarities, which is they've actually confronted their parties and moved them, yeah. made the party change. Tony did with Clause 4, and, and the Keir's done it by ripping anti Semitism out by the roots. So in many ways, Keir is the first uh, Labour leader uh, to build on Tony's legacy. That, um, you always go from Tony straight to Keir, and everybody else in between tried to not be Tony, but Keir's going, oh, he's quite relaxed.